Welcome to Speed Round Sunday on the Parenting Roundabout Podcast, where we share a mini episode from our past for your weekend listening pleasure. We'll be back tomorrow with a brand new episode. So today's question is, what weird food combinations do you really (laughs) enjoy? And Terry said that she has one and she doesn't know if it's weird. And I said that we would be the judge of that. So let's hear it. (laughs) Well, I like eating rice cakes with margarine on them. Is that weird? (laughs) I'm sorry. (laughs) My family refers to them as cardboard. But I tell you, you take one of those... Lightly salted rice cakes, and you slather it with margarine. It's pretty tasty because oh. it tastes like margarine, which is delicious. <laughs> kind of tastes See, like popcorn. I think, I think that thinking like margarine is delicious is weird. <laughs> you think that's weird? Oh. What about butter? Salty. Oh. Well, butter is good, but we have margarine. I, enjoy, I grew up on margarine. I enjoy margarine. But I like butter, too. There you go. <laughs> but I don't have it around. And it would probably break the rice cake unless it was really soft. Yeah, that's true. So what weird thing do you have that I can be all judging on? Me? Yes. Well, I can't, this isn't really a combination. I can't think of any combinations. But I really like Brussels sprouts. And I know that that's like a divisive food. But I think they are so good. Yeah. If yeah. you cook them right. They're yeah, you have to cook delicious. them right. Delicious. My early experience with Brussels sprouts was boiled. Uh, and they're kind of vile that way. But that sounds gross. lately yeah. I have gotten into the, you know, halved and sort of broken up a little bit and sauteed in butter or margarine. And uh, <laughs> until they're kind of browned and delicious. And uh, apparently the secret for me is just it needs to have margarine <laughs> involved and then I'm there. But no, I, the fact that they're broken up into smaller pieces is, I think, a key. Yes, you, and you agree? can just... I I just roast them. I don't yeah. even saute them. But but yes, <sighs> cut in half. Yes, liberal liberally dose with olive oil, <laughs> and there you go. You have to add things that taste good. <laughs> <laughs> I will eat them raw though in a salad. Yeah, too. Mm-hmm. yeah. I don't know. I find them a little dense in their natural state. Well, they're I would eat them raw, but they're like shaved or chopped up ah. a little. Oh, bits. yeah. Yeah. If they're like the little leaves, like like grated or shaved, I would eat that too. Mm-hmm. With with like some delicious dressing on it. <laughs> there you <laughs> go. Oil, a nice vinaigrette. Mm-hmm. Exactly. <laughs> All right, Nicole, we want to hear what yours is. Well, it's not really weird, like if you lived in Australia, but, you know, I know the Americans wouldn't like it, but a Vegemite on toast. I love Vegemite on toast. Oh. Yes. I think yes. I've brought that up before. Um, I've never, I've heard of it and heard that most, many people dislike it. I've never had personal experience with it, but I enjoy that whenever we have a chat on Facebook now, that is a little jar of that is our icon for our conversations. Yes. (laughs) Yes. That's Nicole's avatar right now. Must be (laughs) Nicole. It is. That's me. Uh, Well, it's, you know, it's, it's like peanut butter and to Australians. So I was, my mom is Australian and I was raised on it. So I love Vegemite on my either toasted bread or my not toasted bread. So you ever tried it on a rice cake? Heck no. Not going to. <laughs> <laughs> it's staying on my bread. And it's not with margarine either. I use it with butter. <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right. So we are probably not as weird as we could be. We would like to hear from our listeners weird things that you enjoy.